switchback. Hey guys, Rivet Head here. Welcome back to another daily episode of Cube World. Looking out of the butt of Sniffles. Now we're looking out of the front. Hope everyone has enjoyed themselves today. Let's take a look at where we are. We are we're in good shape. We got stuff to do over that way. Now I did mention in our last video that I was going to get some supplies and stuff, but guess what? I lied. I screwed up. I I have had no time. Today's just been a busy day. Yeah, I mentioned I worked today. Um, I was trying to get a whole bunch of stuff done. I did get an episode of um, uh, Spellbound Caves recorded, and that was good. I had to get the UHC all set up and done, and then that screwed up. That was fun. I was actually on my way to work when it went live, and I saw that I had misspelled UHC. I had spelled it U-C-H or something like that, was being an idiot. So I went to edit it uh, with my app, and when I saved the changes, bloop, deleted the video. I was like, what? So now I've got to re-upload that. So that was fun. Stupid rivet. So I, I, I did tweet and said that I had a mistake and that uh, it was going to be fixed when I got home. Well, it's going to be a little while. Because I deleted the recording. Uh, not the recording. I deleted the uploaded file. So I'm going to have to render that out again. I'm just going to have it up for tomorrow for, for you guys for today. So it will be at 3 o'clock today. Um, you guys may have noticed, too, that I did a cute world at 1 o'clock to kind of balance things out a little bit. Because I was doing it 1 and 3. I thought it would be make sense instead of, like, 2 and 3. Uh, and I'm going to do that again today for you guys, obviously. Because you guys will be watching this now going, Rivet, you're telling me something that I already know. It's 1 o'clock. I'm watching the video, you dingbat. And I'm like, I'm right. I'm a dingbat. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. Uh, now, I did... <laughs> I have a funny experience yesterday. You guys pay attention to the comments. I I said that I uh, apologized and that I was supposed to say uh, thanks to Nathan for showing up and I would called out Nicholas in the first video. Well, it seems we have a new subscriber named Nicholas. <laughs> that was kind of joking around with me about it too. Came over from Armor Time's channel and was, but I came here too. It was kind of funny. It was really cute. Um, and of course, I said that I'd give another shout out today because of the fact that I messed up yesterday. So there we go. Welcome to the channel, Nicholas. Hope you enjoy yourself. And I'll try to uh, not call out anybody else's name today. Because apparently I'm just going to get myself into trouble over and over and over again. So, yeah. Yeah, so I worked today. It was good. It was actually a uh, busy dinner. It was uh, it was nice. It was really nice. And uh, <laughs> uh, my, my, my lady friend that I've been chatting with popped in to uh, say hello. And uh, to get some pizza. And of course, uh, just as she shows up, what happens? I've got, um, I don't know, two tickets of a nightmare that I have to deal with. Normally, I can like hang out for a minute and, and you know, do stuff. The, the job I have is not terribly, um, you know, uh, difficult. I mean, you, you have to be on your on point and everything. But, you know, most of the time, it's like making like subs or salads, that kind of thing. It's easy. Or cooking off wings. So, I mean, I know how to time things and it's simple. Uh, but if you get dinners is when things kind of slow down because you have to do the pastas and make sauces and all that kind of stuff. And it's fine. I mean, I'm good at it. I know what I'm doing. But when somebody pops in to say hello, and then you're like, um, yeah, I've got like six orders standing back there and I can't say hello. So I kind of felt awful and bad, but uh, she understood. She knows that I was working. wasn't giving me a hard time over it. So, but yeah, that was, that was fun. It was, it's always fun when you, you, um, you know, you go to say hello to somebody when they're at work and they really can't say anything because they're at work not the best of places to hang out and chit chat but ah and the th thing is is like uh, like 20 minutes later i had free time i actually like i sat outside for a little while and, and unwound and i was like just dumb luck dumb luck hello gullibles spam oh i missed you i missed it i screwed that up now i don't have any more potions i don't believe so whatever we got is what we got today um, just, eh, it's not the end of the world. Man, the, uh, Scubbles here is just crazy. It's a lot of Scubbles, what I'm alluding to. But anyway, we've got a boss here. We're gonna, oh, God, really? Stupid freaking lake. Hello? Yeah, you're just a regular nomad, I know. I'll take your XP any time of the week. Uh, let's fly over this stupid... Falcor Lake, if this is orange or... Oh, it's white. 
it's white. What does that mean? Like, honestly, what is the, uh, oh, they're blues. Well, it's going to be a nightmare. There is no easy blue. Well, we'll take a look, by all means. I mean, I'm not uh, saying that I won't look at it. I will. It's a crab. Crabs are fun. Okay, well, we're all on our backs. Listen, Spitter, I hate you. I hate everything about you. Uh, well, we're hitting him. Oh, great. He's got a duplicate here. He's going down a little bit. I mean, it's not the end of the world. We need a potion, though. We need him on land. And that's usually what I like to do is to get these guys out and about up on land where we can actually take them on the way they need to be taken on. Which is like, I can run around, and do things and do that and do them the shabams and then give them the whole the whammy and then give them one of those because they love it. Get him, Sneffles! This is, we're on solid ground now. He can't do anything. Crabs don't like being out of water. They don't. See, because they get rushamboed. Oh, God. This is... Oh, great. Double crab. Why aren't you like your clones? It's just easy to take out, huh? Dang bet. Yeah, so today you guys are going to have three videos, it looks like. But it's, you should have been two. Because, well, I've, I've got a duplicate from... Or uh, the, the leftovers from yesterday. I can't believe I did that. I can believe I did it, but it just still stinks. Uh, sometimes apps just blow. Like, you know, and I've, I honestly think that the, um, the studio app that they have for YouTube is actually pretty good. I had liked it. Um, it kind of allows me to look at the videos and look at the comments, and I have a little bit more control over some aspects of things. Uh, but when it comes down to things like this, um, it's where it kind of shows its flaws. And I don't know why I, uh, or no, I had to do that through the regular app, didn't I? I have no idea which app I even used. Oh, God. What am I doing? Hello, Elf! 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 That's right. We need your help. Gotta make short work of this guy. I like I like a water mage on my side. <laughs> That's right, Krabby Boy. You are gonna be the... We're gonna be... You're gonna be toasted. I have no more potions, so if you hit me and wallop on me, I'm toast. I'm done. Wow, he's, even with the two of us just wailing on him, he's just taking forever to go down. That's right, you hit him, Sniffles. Oh, God. Well, we got XP for that guy. There we go. He should be done here any minute. I mean, we really need the XP. I mean, we're so close to um, our next level up. We'll be 92, I would assume, by the end of this one. Oh, God. Why? Why are you in the water? So painful. Level 91. Okay. You got a spare potion there, buddy boy? Uh, let's see what we got here. I don't... I doubt we have a thing. Um, I've got zero bottles. And I've got zero... Ah, oh, I got 15. Heck yeah. We're in good shape. Okay. This makes me very happy. Uh, we have another thing over there. Over here. We can go take a look at. We can do that. That should give me 10? 11. 11 is good. Let's do this thing. Er and then the next level, we will go to the uh, the lovely town. I see insect guards. These guys are just like massive XP, and I love them. Come on, guys. It, it's time to Congo. You ready? Dit, 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 dit. Yeah. That was good. I like those. I like when I get the Congo lines going. And that was actually one of the better uh, lakes I've had to deal with. Oh, yeah, I know. You guys... Get your friends out. We're okay. Come on, everybody. Another conga line. You guys ready? And shabam. Perfectly done. You're a boss. Nope, we're not going to do a conga, conga line of devourers. Uh, heck no. Those guys can just go the way of the dodo. I hate them. They're evil. 
They're evil things. Yeah. Oh, man. So I'm looking forward to tomorrow getting my life back in order. Uh, I might as well tell you the stupidest thing I've done in a long time. Uh, it's, I think it's Saturday. Either Friday or Saturday I went out and I did laundry. Uh, there's a little laundry mat just down the street. And I and I enjoy doing laundry. Like, I, I, I really do. I like going in. Um, you know, it's a nice time for me to un, un, unwind, relax. I, uh, you know, bring my tablet with me with a book. I sit there and I read. And I listen to some music. And it's just time out for myself. I don't go on um, YouTube. I don't do anything. I just, when I'm doing my laundry, that's all I do. Um, so, I have this nice big blue Ikea bag that I carry my laundry in. And it's the perfect size so that when it's full, uh, it's a double load at the laundromat. So, and that's fine. I mean, I'm, like, I've got this down to a science now. You know, five bucks, we'll um, do the laundry and uh, dry everything. So, it's perfect for me. You know, and I, I, I'm in there for about an hour, hour and a half. You know, kind of tune out of society and the world. And I thoroughly enjoy every second of it. Well, when I'm done, I put all of my laundry back into the bag. Um, and I put my, my detergents and everything in there, too. And I usually have a little plastic bag for them. So everything is fine. Strap it all tight down to the back of my bicycle, and away I go. You know, I, you know, it's not too far from my house. It's only, like, like maybe three-quarters of a mile. Like, it's not far. So I got home, um, and instead of putting the laundry away, I just hung it up on my, um, on my door, on the handle. Just the bag. The bag has got big handles on it. So I just like, yeah, I'll get at this. I, I don't need it until... I go to work, um, and so I had a change of clothes already set up for yesterday. Today, I went and go to pull out my laundry. Yep, the detergent had exploded all over everything. Uh, how I didn't smell it, how I didn't see it, I have no idea, but I did it. I ruined a whole bag of laundry. Now, it wasn't like, it's not that I, like, I'm never going to be able to use it or anything. That's not it, but... Um, couldn't use it today for work, um, so what I ended up doing is uh, <laughs> I just rewashed it in the sink. Um, took out a pair of shorts and uh, a work shirt and washed them, and then I just ended up wearing my dirty clothes from yesterday because it was like I I don't I can't just like wear anything to work. Um, I, I'm allowed to. It's not that I, I'm not allowed to, but the thing is, is like when you're working around fryer and the ovens and everything, uh, there is a restaurant stink. That, I mean, I don't hate the smell. I, I really doesn't bother me. But it gets in everything that you wear to work. And there's no getting it out. Like, I could wash my clothes a million times, and it's going to still stink of work, no matter what I do. So, ah, <laughs> set cards. So, yeah, that was, um, I, I just basically had to wear, you know, just dirty clothes from yesterday. It wasn't the end of the world. I mean, honestly, I mean, my... By the time I'm at work, my clothes are dirty anyway. I mean, like, it takes, like, all of 20 minutes to where I want to get into a change of clothes at work anyway. So it was like, eh, whatever. So, and I was only working a half shift today, thankfully. So that was nice. I've noticed that it's been a bunch of insect guards. And then it was, like, I'll see devourers. Where we got porcupines this time. But these guys have got, like, really good XP, too. What is it, 11? That's decent XP. I mean, I just got 77 onionlings. It's like gaggles of everybody today. This is great. And it's like one shot everybody, and then I'm just yakking away, one shotting them. Dig that. This is fun. I'm enjoying today. This is exactly what I needed. A nice little unwind. So, yeah. Um, yeah, for today's episode, you guys have got uh, two Minecraft and one Cube World. Not bad. Uh, then tomorrow. We should be back on the regular things. I think, like I mentioned, I'm going to have to do laundry again. So I may, and I'm going to be tired. So I may just keep it at the two videos for tomorrow. I've got um, another UHC and a, um, I'll do a cube world. Because that's what I do. Let me, where? I was like, where? Why isn't he showing up? I kept on hitting T and no sniffles. I just want to see what this boss is. This is like I, I've mentioned them before. If it's something that's like way overpowered, we're not doing it. Um, if it's another thing like we just did, like, you know, you just keep whacking at the guy and he kind of creeps down, I'm not doing that either. If this is a Saurian troll lich, um, obviously not a Yeti. 
Uh, Cyclops, those guys, you know, they're easy peasy and out. Boom, squash, make them feel awful, and then we're good. But we are so close. I'm getting a feeling that this is going to be one of those things. I don't see... Listen, Beatles. Have you ever tried to look at a map while being on a on a desert runner? It's not an easy. I'm oh, malt. I no mat. Okay. I don't know what the heck I just did there. I kind of froze the computer and everything at the same time. We still don't know what it is. Dun 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 dun. dun. It's gonna be somebody. I'm going to call a troll. It's going to probably be a Saurian again. We'll find out. Shouldn't be but a hot second here. The ruins? What? How did... How did... Huh? How did that happen? I don't get it. Oh! They're all over the place. How did I not spot these things? Because they just look like lumps of dirt. Listen, you. That's right. What are you at? Uh, Nomad. Is this is. Oh, God. This is gonna be bad. No, you can't beat me up. You're not allowed to. Well, let's go check it out. Um. Get back behind us. I'm just trying to find the boss because we're at that time of the day where it should be easier to spot them. And I've, I'll have i show you what I'm thinking is that uh, it's got to be over here. Come on, Sniffles. There should be a pink glow around one of these buildings. I don't see one yet. What? Ow! Wow, you guys are not even messing around. Holy crap! Good God! You guys done yet? Ha ha ha! Did you like that move? Bet you didn't. What? How did you get up there? That's a lot of stuff. Okay, let's get up here. Yeah. Yeah, okay. There is... Okay, let's see where we're at here. These ruins are usually fairly easy to just, like, to go through. But every now and again, you get the wonky one. And it looks like we might have gotten one of those wonky ones. We'll just go through this side. He may be over here. Because sometimes it kind of carries down into the next area. It's hard to tell. I don't see him. Listen, you. Why are you so angry? Huh? Oh, we're dead. What is... Wah! Okay. These, this is not... This is bad. I have angered every djinn, every nomad. Oh, and they're all just wailing on me. Just like nobody's business. Yeah. Well. Poop that place. I'm, I'm keeping my light off just so I can see real quick. Anything. I don't see a darn thing here. I mean, it should be behind us, and I haven't seen it, and I've not, I haven't seen anything yet except for my face getting wrecked. But anyway, we're gonna call it here, everybody. Maybe we'll come back tomorrow and take a look and see if we could find the boss here. Who, who knows? But hey, we did one. That was fun. We got our butts kicked in the second one. That was fun. Um, we got to hang out in Sniffle's butt when we started the game, but that's not so much fun because he farts a lot. I mean, he eats a lot of pixels, and they're full of fiber. They're nasty. Nasty. But anyway, 
Thanks again for all of your continued support, everybody. And I will see you all tomorrow in our next episode of Cube World. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. Twitch battle.